Hello everyone, this is Donna of Prima Donna Kraus back again with another mini. Um, this is a very special kind of mini because I've never ever tried it before and um, it is like a folder mini of some sort with um, different sections and the inspiration from this mini came from um, a video um, and um, it is from somebody called Elise4432. It is called, um, I think, Mini Album Curio and um, it is in French, so obviously I'm pronouncing it wrong. But um, the person who uh, made this mini, I wrote to her and I think her name is Elise and uh, asked her for instructions but um, I never heard from her so I decided to sort of figure it out myself and um, it's sort of um, similar but um, I did make a few um, changes. Anyway, the paper collection that I've used for this mini is from Pink Paisley. Um, I've lost the, um, the name uh, but it's this set, you know, very pretty pages. This actually reminds me of the Gabriel from Bow Bunny, but um, it's Pink Paisley. And um, back to the mini. Um, this uh, mini, um, th for the front, I used a magnetic closure, but it did not work. It um, was supposed to um, look like this, but as the closure did not work um, and uh, it seemed to sort of pop open, I decided to um, have it this way for the time being until I can figure out how to um, um, close the mini properly. So what I've done is I've used um, a die and cut out, uh, die cut this um, cardstock and added some paper on top. I've used bits and pieces from other collections like K and Company. This is a K and Company paper. And um, then I've also die cut this bird and um, cut out this um, butterfly. It makes the page pop actually and added some bling. So I'm quite happy with the way it turned out. But of course, you know, it would have been nicer maybe that way. Who knows? Right, and then it opens up into three sections. And I'm going to back the video so that I can get it all in. So it's got three sections, the middle and then the two sides. So this bit belongs to that side. And uh, here, before I cover it, I've stamped this image and uh, this is a chipboard actually. Very happy with the way it turned out. And um, the stamps, uh, you know, I had these set, stamps, set of stamps lying in my stash for yet a, a, a very long time. and. That's what it is. And it went very well with this um, line of papers. Okay? Right. So I stamped the dragonfly from that um, set. And then this opens up that way. And there are two flip um, pages. One, two. Plenty of room actually for journaling. And uh, this flips out that way. It's a pocket and it contains a tag. And um, this is, um, I'm very pleased with the way this, how this tag turned out. And of course this is Tim Holes and this is Seven Gypsies, this bit here. Very pretty. And more Tim Holes stamp. Love the way this um, tag turned out. And um, right, so this one also flips back okay and the pages are so um, colors are so pleasing so this is another pocket with uh, two tags again uh, this time i worked quite hard on my tags and um, i hope you notice and these are various tans actually theresa collins ali edwards um, there's the seven gypsies and uh, even Maya Road, I think that is a wing from Maya Road. Okay, so that flips back there and I've got these die cut labels stuck as well for more space. So this is the middle portion 
and um, so here is a sort of a side pocket I love this um, base actually so this is the base and I've stamped that um, I think this is a B and then it's got the Z <laughs> cute and then this is an image from the paper collection so um, this sort of enhances the images says me so this is um, a tag very simple with a cut out there and uh, this is another tag. So um, the colors really coordinate. So coming to this side, I've got this uh, frame and look at what beautiful paper this is. Really, really pretty. You don't need to do much actually. So this is a very interesting page. It, o it flips like that and then it opens up like that and like that. So plenty of room for photos and journaling and whatnot and beautiful paper really really beautiful paper so it closes like that and then again and uh, this is a, a base and I've stamped this butterfly very pretty very pretty papers so the book closes this way so starting from the base then the pocket goes over this goes over and then another pocket to um, flip pages you can call that and then for the time being this goes first this shipboard and um, yeah and then this side goes over that all right isn't that sweet? I love it. It took me ages to figure out, um, actually two days. And the part that did me in was this one. You know, it just did my head in, but it was the simplest of the whole lot. Would you believe it? So the golden rule is keep it simple, stupid, the kiss rule. Um, anyway, so um, this is my mini or with inspiration from Elise. And um, let me know what you think of this mini I love it and I think I'm going to call it the curio mini like Elise and thank you very much Elise for the inspiration and you guys let me know what you think of this mini thank you bye